Hello there everyone, this is Schweb. Um, we are recording the first video, the intro, right now. Um, and it's about the 5 minute max, the show. It's a daily 5 minutes of your time and you'll be learning something new and exciting. That's a promise. So what we are going to learn in this version of 5 minute max is uh, RDS 3 series max. And I'm using 2012 version which is... Uh, 64 bit um, You can see that it's written right there in your program name and uh, when you open the max uh, More or less the interface looks like just like that uh, not not exactly like this one, but uh, uh, This is the basic uh, scene that you will see so it has not lots of bells and whistles and uh, lots of buttons functions sets some of the windows with lots of uh, rollouts we'll be learning all of them one by one, um, if you just follow along with me, and um, there will be guests in uh, some of the lectures, and um, uh, I'll always going to l let you know that uh, the shortcut keys and uh, how to approach to model something complex in a different way. So uh, now, just like let me run down and let you guys know what are the you know, what are the table of contents will look like. We'll be learning from the uh, main toolbar and there's menu and we'll be learning this common panel which is on my right now but for you guys uh, it could be on your left but uh, my mouse settings are different um, so before saying uh, the table table of contents uh, let me introduce myself uh, uh, I'm a 3d artist and been using uh, Macs for quite a while now I started uh, studying computer science um, focused towards CG um, computer graphics and uh, I have worked with uh, several different projects uh, on the process after graduation I have worked with uh, TV commercial web commercial uh, short animated features and uh, also um, different types of projects which uh, includes character animation my major and focus was character animation so um, 3D Studio Max is one of the tools that I use but I use uh, other tools as well um, uh, like Maya, Cinem 4D, After Effects, all those. Uh, I've been working for the industry for more than three years now and uh, professionally before that I used to work as a student but um, professionally working three years and uh, looking forward to like work more. Uh, I've been using from the earlier version of Max, uh, 3D Studio Max and it wasn't uh, under Autodesk at that time, it was under Discrete. Um, lots of things has changed and lots of new features came some of the features were altered but mostly appended on the newer versions so uh, that's my introduction um, so I'll be teaching you every day five minutes um, all you have to do is subscribe or uh, go to the link um, and um, watch the shows which will be coming uh, you can also like us on the Facebook so the first one uh, we'll be dealing with is a common panel uh, after we get through this uh, uh, essential menu bar so and the common panel has lots of functions and buttons and the creating tabs sets of tabs drop down list and lot other things we'll be like dealing with all of them this program creates uh, insane amounts of uh, 3d animation um, short commercials to like film uh, GG Max has been used for like uh, very very good and hit movies uh, and this one is constantly been using in the architecture industry to like create uh, different types of uh, rendering or arc visualizations because lots of people out there consider GG Max to be like one of the best tool for creating static uh, um, uh, rendering scene or it's good for modeling some of them say it has a very good feature uh, which is poly modeling tool uh, I hotkeyed it and we'll be seeing that some um, additional features will come down like these uh, extra tools um, we'll be learning all of them including how did I change the hotkey there so uh, in this introduction uh, um, I'm just like giving you guys the rundown how the show will be divided. Um, sometimes there will be episodes with like questions 
and after a few episodes i will be like pausing and like giving you guys a, a uh, like a summary of like previous five or six classes so hope you guys always um, log in subscribe and like keep watching all these uh, videos and we'll be seeing you on episode two which will be coming next day